Good night, guys. This is the television game in which daring determines the fate of the player. This is the game of strategy, luck, and knowledge. And I am Rightly1279. Alright guys, thank you for joining us for Bullseye on the Rightly1279 channel. Glad to have you with us. We're going to have an awesome time. I can feel it. We've been having a great week this week. We're giving away over, we're giving away a total of 2,556,000 huge dollars between these contestants. Give them a hand. And we're going to try to do more. Now, I will make your announcement because everybody on the call felt this was a good idea. So I will make the announcement very quickly. In the bonus game, you know how when you get three bullseyes and one single to spin, you'll win $1 million. Well, that still stands. But say if they manage to do it on their very first spin. Well, it won't be $1 million. We'll double the total to $2 million. Yeah! Yeah! More on that later, but right now, um, we're going to have our two players. Now, AJ had something to do today, so he will not be able to uh, uh, do his championship, but he uh, has uh, his uh, uh, replacement that is going to play on his behalf or on his own behalf. We have Eric Lima, who has one win and $128,000. How you doing, Eric? I'm doing great. <laughs> Why are you ready? Are you ready to add to your winnings? I'm ready. Hopefully, be a millionaire by the time. All right. Good luck to you and um, his opponent, who has uh, won the won the million dollars. He has two wins. He has a total of one million one forty three thousand five hundred dollars. Is Brody Young? How you doing, Brody? <laughs> I'm doing great. How about you today? Good, good, good. Well, do you feel like you're going to win more millions? Well, like uh, like Classo, our boy said, only time will tell. All right. Good luck to y'all, too. Okay, y'all know how to play the game. The idea of Bullseye, guys, is for them to answer questions, to complete contracts, to win the game. And... The first player to win $2,000 at the end of this game will go on to the bonus game, which can actually pay off $2 million, okay? All right, well, All right. here are the uh, categories for today's game. In the left window, we have, we have hockey, the card game, 2,000 pop hits, U.S. Geography, and Monopoly. And in the right window, we have on the farm, nursery rhymes, abbreviations, and Harry Potter. And in the bottom window, that's the number of questions you have to answer in order to complete the contract, okay? All right. If you should hit that bullseye right there, you can answer as many questions as you would like to, and also you can stop whenever you like, okay? Okay. So with that all said, we're going to start with you, Eric. And Eric, when Alrighty. I start the reels, you stop them. Here we go. And I will stop right now. Here we go. We have hockey, the card game for $200, nursery rhymes for $300, and the contract is, wow, five questions. Okay. Wow. Uh, Eric, which category would you like to go with? Please. Repeat it again. Nursery rhymes. He's going with nursery rhymes. Okay. And this contract is worth $15. Hundred dollars, and you can collect that after you answer these questions. Good luck to you, Eric. All right, thank you. In the nursery rhyme, Hickory Dickory Dock, what time is the clock striking when the mouse runs down? Is One. it? Say that again. One. One is right. You did not need the choices. Good job. All right, you have uh, four questions to go in order to complete the contract. Here's the next one. Finish this nursery rhyme. Twinkle, twinkle, little star. Is it A, like a diamond in the sky? B, how I want to see you closely? C, how I want to touch you? Or D, how I wonder what you are? 
How I twinkle, twinkle, little star. How I wonder what you are. That is right. You did it. Good job. We have $600 in the pot. Three questions to go in order to complete the contract. Your next one. Hickory Dickory Dock, the blank ran up the clock. Fill in that blank. Is it A, mouse, B, dog, C, gerbil, or D, cat? Mouse. Mouse is right. Good job. <laughs> Two more questions to go in order to complete the contract, Eric. Your next one. Finish the rhyme. Jack Spratt could eat no fat. His wife could eat no what? Is it A, meat, B, lean, C, vegetables, or D, eggs? Repeat the, um, the question, please. Jack Spratt could eat no fat. His wife could eat no what? Is it A, meat, B, lean, C, vegetables, or D, eggs? Mm. Meat? Meat is incorrect. I'm sorry. Ah. All right, uh, Brody, you can take control. Jack Spratt could eat no fat. His wife could eat no what? Is it B, lean, C, vegetables, or D, eggs? Uh, I'll go with B, lean. Lean is right. Good job, Brody. All right. All right, we have one more question to complete the contract. Okay, here's your ne next one, Brody. Mary had a little right. lamb, little lamb, finish the rhyme. Is it A, it liked to eat the grass? B, it wandered off in the meadow. C, its fleece was white as snow. Or D, it grew up to be a mama lamb. Its fleece was white as snow. You completed the contract. That is nicely done. All right, All right, Brody. So you finished the contract. Now you have a decision to make. There's $1,500 in the pot. You can bank it, and it will be your money. But control will go back to Eric or... You can risk that $1,500 and go for a new contract. What do you want to do? Let's keep the money in the bank. Let's, let's keep the money in the pot and go for a new contract. He's going for a new contract. Okay. All right. We are going to start the reels. You tell me when to stop them. Here we go. All right. Here we go. And stop. Here we go. $2,000 by hits. $200. Abbreviations, $200. And the contract is five questions. All right, wow. which one you want to go with? I'll take abbreviations for $200. All right, and this contract is worth $1,000. That means whoever completes this contract will win this game because there will be more than $2,000 in the pot. In fact, somebody will win $2,500. And this is your question, Brody. All right. What classic rock band is abbreviated CCR? Is it A... Clayton's Cooperative, let me try again, Clayton's Cooperative Rush, B, Credence Clearwater Revival, C, Coward County Rangers, or D, Crazy Creek Reunion? I'm going to go with option A. Clayton Cooperative Rush is wrong. Mm. Ah. All right, uh, um, Eric, you can take control. What classic rock band is abbreviated CCR? Is it A, Credence Clearwater Revival? Let me try again. Credence Clearwater Revival, C, Coward County Rangers, or D, Crazy Creek Reunion? Credence Clearwater Revival. That is the right answer. Good job. Four questions to go in order to win the game. $1,700 in the pot. Your Here's your next question. What is Mark, that's M-A-R-C, a standard for? Is it A, musical notation, B, cataloging, C, radiography, or D, cartography? Hmm. That's a tough one. Let's try option C. Radiography is incorrect. Okay. All right, you can take over control, Brody. What is Mark a standard for? Is it A, musical notation, B, cataloging, or D, cartography? Hmm. I'll try cartography. Cartography is wrong. Ah. The answer was cataloging. The 
uh, initials for Mark is Machine Redable Catalog Gang, okay? Oh, okay. All right, it's back to um, Eric. Four questions left to complete the contract, okay? Got it. The state postal abbreviation for West Virginia is what? Is it A, WVG, C, WVA, C, V, A, W in parentheses, or D, W, V? W-V. That is right. Good job. Three questions to go in order to win the game. $1,900 is in the pot. Here is the next question. The military abbreviation APO stands for what? Is it A, Army? Sorry, guys. My camera clicked off there. Um, So we'll try the question again. All right. Here's your question again, Eric. The military abbreviation APO stands for what? Is it A, Army Private Office, B, Army Post Office, C, Army Police Operations, or D, Air Force Public Officer? Hmm. Army Post Office? That is right. Good job. Two questions to go in order to win the game. There's $2,100 in the pot. Your next one, um, Eric. Okay. If your online friend tells you that she and her man are dink, that's D-I-N-K, D-I-N-K, dink, what does she mean? Is it A, dual income, no kids, B, dabbling in Nokia stocks, C, doubtful income, not kings, or D, darn idiots, no kitty. <laughs> I'm gonna say the first one there, dual income. No, dual income, no kids? Mm. That is right! Oh. All right, so that is $2,300 in the pot. Now we have one question left. Answer this question right, Eric, and you'll win the game. Miss this question, and if Brody answers it right, he'll win the game. All right, here's your question. Best of luck. Why would you go to weekly AA meetings? Is it A, weight problem, B, to discuss books, C, because you're looking for a man, or D, alcoholic problem? Alcoholic problem. You have won the game, Eric. Good job. We add $2,500 to your score. That takes your total to $130,500, Eric. Good job. And you're going to go ahead um, to play the bonus island in a second. Well, Brody, thanks for playing with us, man. You're welcome, Rodney. All right, guys. All right, thank you, thank you. We're going to take a break, and when we come back, we'll do the bonus island right after this. Don't all right, guys, welcome back to Bullseye, and we're ready to do Bonus Island with Eric. Well, Eric, are you ready to play the Bonus Island? Run over there and spin some information. Here we go. Come over here. Let's do the Bonus Island. Everybody, may I explain the rules to him? Go ahead. All right, so now... I'll, I'll explain that to the YouTube audience how this is going to work, who are joining us for the first time. You see those swirls that are swirling around? Eric has to try to rack up as much money as he can and, and add it to the jackpot. If he gets if he gets three bullseyes in any one of his three in any one of his spins, we will dump money that's in the jackpot and add $100,000. But... Behind one of those swirls is that dreaded lightning. The one thing that Eric has to stay away. Is that right? What is it like the plague? That is correct. And if you hit that lightning, you'll lose everything, but not the money that you have won in the main game, because that's yours to keep. Yes. Now, if you manage to get three bullseyes on your front spin, We'll not just give you one million dollars. We're gonna double it to two million dollars. You heard that, folks? Yes. If he gets it on his first spin, with his which is right here, 
it is two million dollars one time only but if you get it on a regular single spin it's one million okay and you just stop and take your money along the way eric if you want to okay got it all right well if you're ready to go eric uh this one is for two million dollars if three bull's eyes come up so tell me when you want me to stop it Okay, here we go. Four, three, two, one. Now, Rodney. Here we go. Bullseye! 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 Oh, boy! I thought we had it right away. That was close. But, Eric, you do have two bullseyes right there, okay? Now, I think this is going to be an easy decision. Yep. I think the love if, if a lightning is behind one of those two bullseyes, he could be saved and he could go on to win one million dollars. Right. It goes through ten spins without hitting the lightning, but we don't know where that lightning could be. Right. So I, we yeah. offer. So I will offer you one thousand dollars to walk away, or you can risk it all for your second spin. Alrighty. All right. Thousand dollars. Let's let's spin the information because I'm spinning with the odds here in my favor. All right. Good luck. Here's all your right, second spin. There you go, Eric! Boom! There you go. Now you have another decision to make, Eric. Now you have a hundred and two thousand dollars right now. You could take the hundred and two thousand dollars and add it to your winnings or if you want to be daring again, we'll unlock all these bullseyes. You can risk all the wondering two thousand dollars for your third spin. But keep in mind, if you get the lightning, you'll lose this wondering two thousand dollars. So what do you want to do? All right. You know what? Let's try it. I'm gonna go for my third spin. Let's let's Whoa. be daring. Him. Good luck. He's daring. Here we go. Unlock all the wheels and let's go for it. Good luck. Concentrate, concentrate, and now. Here we go. $3,000, $3,000, and a bullseye. Okay, bullseye. now this makes it a little difficult. Now, $1,000. Now, do you want to take that $108,000 now, or do you want to go for spin number four? What do you want to do? I'm going for spin number four. Let's spin that ball. Let's spin the All ball. right. Be careful. Now, though, you may be safe down there. You may not be. Here we go. Well, where are they? All right. Two more bullseyes. Now, come on. Stop. Oh, Here we go. $2,000 and $3,000. $113,000. Same option. You want to take that $113,000 and stop right now, or do you want to go for your fifth spin? So good. Let's keep going. Here we go. Good luck. Off the board. Here we go. Two thousand dollars and another. again. Another five thousand dollars. Now you had a hundred and eighteen thousand dollars. Same option. Apply. A hundred eighteen thousand dollars. You can walk away with that or risk it all and go for your six spin. What do you want to do, Eric? What's your decision? I have a feeling. I have, I have a feeling the lightning's in the bottom window. I gotta go. Gotta Good luck to you. Here we go. Be careful. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Do one stop. Here we go. Bullseye in. Bullseye. Good stuff. Three hundred thirty-six thousand dollars. Yes, we. Oh, yeah. We Here was the situation. No, I you have $336,000. Hmm. You have four spins left to go. Do you want to do, do you want to go for your seventh spin and unlock all the wheels because you'll be risking $336,000. But remember, Eric, if you do go and you know you mess around and, and hit lightning. lightning, you lose $336,000. Well, I'll but it. if you go Four spins without hitting lightning, you'll win one million dollars. What's your decision? Do it again. He's gonna go for it. All right, Eric. Again. Good luck. Here we go. Good luck. Ah, the board. Here we go. 
thousand dollars. Bullseye, and you're up to three hundred and forty thousand dollars, Eric. Forty thousand dollars. Boy. Now, do you want to take the three hundred forty thousand dollars and stop right now, or do you want to go for your eight spin and try to rack up more money? Let's try for me. If you hit lightning, you'll lose everything. He's gonna go for it. He he's, yeah, he's going for it. Good luck, Gary. Three hundred forty thousand on the line. Last game before. Here we go. Thousand dollars in. Three hundred and forty-four thousand. dollars. Now you have two spins to go. A million dollars is within your reach. Oh boy. You have three hundred and forty-four thousand dollars and one bullseye. Do you want to take that three hundred forty-four thousand dollars and stop, or do you want to go for your ninth spin? Because if it hit lightning. You lose everything. But if you go two more spins, that's a million dollars. What do you want to do? I feel daring. Let's go for number nine. Go ahead. Go for it. Good luck. All right. Stop. Bullseye in. Bullseye. Now, I think I should... I should get Eric to understand this. I think I'll take over for this one, Brody. Eric, now listen very carefully. Now you have $788,000 right now. And you have one spin to go. Now, if you want to, you can take the $788,000 and add it to your total. Or you can risk all $788,000 for another $212,000. But remember, you hit lightning, you're going to lose $788,000 here. I want to make this interesting. Let's go for spin number 10. Okay. All right. This is for $1 million or nothing. It could be the greatest move in history or the boneheaded move. Here we go. The final spin of the bonus island. Here we go. Stop. Bullseye! Bullseye in! You got a million dollars in! Good job! So we add that. That's how you play bullseye. That's, That's right. Yeah. Hashtag risk taker. Yeah, he's got guts. So you're up to one million one hundred and thirty thousand five hundred dollars, Eric. And you're a third millionaire. Uh, uh, yep. And he can moves on to second place on the leaderboard. Yes, he does. Yep. Now, now let's find out where that lightning was. Top right. It was in the top was right. Top right. Dustin was right. He was flirting with the fire all along. Now, guys, we're going to take a break, and when we come back, and I know we're out of time here because Boris has to get to his game. When we come back, we'll have closing remarks. Don't go away. Good job, Eric. Thank you. Thank you. Alright guys, we found out that we do not have time to do a second game because Boris is going to do um, 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 Pointless oh, right pointless. after this. So, but I want to recap on something. We get we have three million dollar winners within the first five episodes, which is decent. So, oh, Boris said he lost his internet connection on his PC. Oh, that's very good. But I'm still ending the episode anyway. So, um, I want to recap. Um, on uh, the week, we have given away $3,686,500 in one week. So, if this keeps on happening, we might end up, on the rate we're going, we might end up giving away $15 million in 
um, 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 in 25 episodes. But we're going to see what happens, guys. Well, this is Rodney1279 signing off saying be safe, be careful, take care, everybody, and whatever you look for in life, be sure to what, Brody? Make sure, make sure that you hit the bullseye! See you guys later. Now I'm going to have to reply back to Boris. Unless AJ comes on, yeah, it'll be the Eric against AJ. Dial one more, again. <laughs>